Alrighty guys, I want to see what happens if I try to do this. I've been trying most of the morning to get myself ready to go out and do errands. And the entire family has decided that they must run around and yell. <laughs> anyway, I picked up a $5 profusion that's all in yellow. So I put on my mustard yellow sweater and figured I would play with the yellow. Unfortunately, this bit comes off. I may see if I can stick it on the other way around so at least it's still on the lid because it's kind of cute. It looks like an old style cassette. Why? I don't know, but hey. But the colors are pretty cool. Yes, I'm trying to get you lined up. Now I've thrown it in the floor. Ha! No breaks. Yay. Having one of those days, you know? My usual favorite white. Now I have played with this a little bit, but not really done much of anything with it other than just put some of it on my skin because I have a fair bit of undertone in yellow. And I was a little worried how this was going to work. Now, the first time I did it, I used my beige primer. So, we shall see. We shall see what happens. Now, the first time I did this, I used Epic first. I'm thinking about using Bro this time. There are quite, there's only really two shimmers in this, and it's Headliner and Gnarly. Bro is this yellow over here. First time I did it, I started over here with Epic. Now, remember, I have hooded eyes, so I'm putting everything up higher. to account for my hooded eyes, which are evil things. They're a pain in the butt. Butt pain. Butt pain. I'm going to have to check and see how my sound is doing this time. Last couple of times I've done a film speaking pretty close to what I normally speak, it's come out really, really quiet. So I've tried resetting where the camera 
is since the camera and the mic are one unit it's a webcam and we will see if that's any better yes I'm still checking over in the monitor because this is still kind of a newer lighting and camera setup so we'll see what happens take a little bit of cliff which is the chocolate brown now this profusion is a little bit of a pain compared to the ones that I've had before because it just it's got a lot more kick up in the mats than I'm used to with a profusion palette It just, I'm not used to this much kick up. It's not terrible, but like Epic the other day was really dusty. is not doing too bad. Bro did not do too bad. I said Epic was and Safari were just really dusty. So far, so good. What in the world is on my sweater? I haven't even got out the house yet. I've already got my sweater messed up. Okay, let's see where I'm going to go next. I think I'm just going to do the headliner, which is this shimmer here and then I'll get to gnarly get my spritzer was fun. The newest addition to the house. 
Charlie's eldest daughter is having an inhaler emergency. So, and she had one the other day. I handed off the inhaler to my son, and I haven't seen it since, so. There's a bunch of us here that have inhaler requiring issues. Now, looking at this particular color in the pan, I really didn't expect quite this shade because in the pan it looks kind of dull. But yeah, slide a little of this down here. Got a bunch of glitter glues, all kinds, including Elf. And I'm going to take just a little bit of glitter glue. I'm going to pop it right in here. And then I'm going to pick up with my finger some of the gnarly. And I'm going to pop that right here. And it doesn't want to go. Let's see if it'll go with the brush. good the other day with just a spray. So I don't know, maybe it's just being persnickety today. Anyway, got a little extra shine there. Not lots, but a little. other eye. No, I don't normally do this kind of stuff. Because my eyes like to argue. It's one of the problems of having hooded eyes is trying to get things so they can be seen as well as not having them look just plain weird. Because they've like creased up or something like that. Got a little rag down here. I'm wiping the brush on. 
try to make sure I don't leave too much sticky on the brush until I get it to the wash. Use that brush just a little bit more. Put it in that brown and come under here just a little stronger. pretty good. Now, when I wore this out the other day, it looked pretty good. I had a gentleman at a store manage to find me a way to find a way to get me a discount on something that I was picking up for somebody else. Cuz I don't mope no more. But since I was going out, anyway, to pick up some stuff, I went ahead and picked up for them so that we wouldn't have to put more people out of the house going to do things. Alright, I'm going to get off of here for a second. Well, for you it's a second. For me it'll take a bit. i got to finish putting my face on. And we will go from there. Okay. Got some stuff powdered down. I've got an illuminating palette. And fresh flawless palette. Both of them are elf. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to start with the Fresh Flawless. Pick up the bronzer that's down here in the corner because I prefer the matte for my bronzer. I just, I do. I can put a little shine in the blush, but I prefer matte for the bronzer. Usually use matte for the blush too, but a little sparkle doesn't bother me. I don't know why the bronzer does. Okay, and then that was the bronzer down here, and I'm going to go over here and pick up the blush. Still matte. See, I think I think I'm going to stick with that kind of subtle tone here. I'm just going to the drugstore. It's not even a grocery store, it's just the drugstore. Picked up this color down here. That's the only thing that bugs me with some of the e.l.f. stuff. 
is if you don't remember what the colors supposedly are, you're SOL on names. But this is the Fresh Flawless palette. Uh, excuse me. No, this is the Illuminating palette. The Fresh Flawless palette was the uh, silver one. Both of them I've gotten as gifties for ordering, which I think is kind of nice. I've got a little bit of liner on. I haven't sprayed anything yet. I'm about to do that. I'll use this one because the other one got moved. There, there it is. It's hiding behind my mirror. I've still got this cover girl lock it up with the cucumber scent. <laughs> My homemade one doesn't have any scent in particular. Hmm. Now, the hubs fussed at me the other day because I didn't put anything bluey green in the look to go with the hair so that things kind of melded in a little better. I'm still not. I'm being a pain. Yeah, this is Physician's Formula Healthy Lip. And I can't currently read the label. I like this stuff. Looks good. Okay, now before anybody starts jumping up and down about how gorgeous this necklace is, it's resin. It's not amber. It's commercial resin. It's not from a, fo a fossilized part of tree resin. This is not real amber. But that's okay. Real amber happens to be a little expensive. Which is really annoying. because I really like real amber a lot, but it's expensive. <laughs> I got this little set off of the app called Top Hatter that's supposed to be 
um, you know, the 90 second auctions. Well, that's not quite what I was hoping for, but oh well. I need a slightly shorter bar, and those haven't come in yet. See, I've got these nifty tunnels, but that's not working for me today. I need a slightly shorter bar for putting those little earrings like that in. Because if it's too long, it hangs out of the tunnel and looks strange. Which I'll just put on a different pair. It's got the little back latch. And okay, it doesn't match the rest of the jewelry, but nothing ever does. I'm just like that. Anyway. Slap some mascara on. get myself ready and go do these errands. It's 12.15 here on the Pacific Coast. Well, I'm only sort of on the Pacific Coast. The far edge of Oregon is on the Pacific Coast. I'm on next to the border with Idaho. If I go the closest route into Idaho to get any place of any size, I go through a little town in Oregon called Ontario, and then I cross the Snake River into Idaho and right there is one of the main Orida plants. So if you've ever wondered why Orida potatoes are called Orida, it's because they're right here on the Oregon Idaho border. That's why. There. Alrighty. One each yellow look with the yellow sweater. Tell me what you think. I dare you. Anyway, time to go erranding. Be good. Mm -hmm.